sisters and one brother, and that's just on my dad's side. My mom is one of five siblings, so I definitely have a shitload of relatives. <laughs> so, and they're all El Paso, yeah. I don't think I have family in El Paso, Texas. I think it's more San Antonio and um, El Paso. I don't think I have family there, but I think they're not far. I think it's like more so like an hour from there. How far away is San Antonio? I'm not very geographically inclined person. <laughs> Or like, where is the river walk in Texas? I've been there. Is that San Antonio? Okay. Dallas, okay. San Antonio. Yes, I have family in San Antonio. We like, so growing up, so my grandparents live in Mexico. Both sets of my grandparents live in Mexico. And we never flew to Mexico, ever. We always drove. That's not a fun drive. P.S. If you were wondering. Um, but anytime that we would make the trip to Mexico, we always stayed with family in Texas. That was like, instead of staying at a hotel um, before we went to Mexico, we would stay with family in Texas before we made the crossing of the border into Mexico, like the um, evening before. You haven't dealt with traffic coming back from Mexico. Uh, yeah, it's just that process of um, coming. back from the border. Yeah, Houston. Also, I have family in Houston as well. Yes, I speak Spanish. Spanish was my first language. Um, like I said, both of my sets of my grandparents are live in Mexico. My mom was born in Mexico, but my dad was born in California. You didn't need passports back then? I actually don't remember, now that you say that, I don't remember having a passport being young, but I don't know what age you had to have one, but I do remember having one when I was like, Spanish. I've never been in Dallas. Yeah, I would imagine being that close to the border. Um, I don't like. For some things, it would probably be worth it to cross and get. Some, some things would be cheaper, but um, I feel like it would just be a hassle <laughs> to just make that trip of crossing the damn border. Oh, okay. Wisconsin? I was just in Wisconsin last year. Uh, when you come back on the US side, gotcha. From Halpa, Zacatecas? Yes, actually. Have you heard me say that before or were you guessing? Who's the hot intern? I don't know. 
What are you talking about? Me? Piscata? Yes. Yes, I do. Actually, one of my co-workers, he's made it for us every year. He um, is also Mexican. He's from Chihuahua. He's made it, like I said, he's made it for us every year. It is so good. And he even, like, he's a welder, and he's even welded, like, the, um, this, like, thing to make it in. Yes, it is so good. Am I Mexican? Yes, both of my parents are Mexican, and like I said, my grandparents, great-grandparents, am of Mexican descent. The walk, is that way, what is that what it's called? The actual name? Am I still in the army? Yes. My husband is not Mexican. He is not. Do I help out my family when it comes to making tamales for Christmas? Yes, I do. Like I said, my family, my, my parents live very close by, so um, I go over early to help my mom make the tamales for everybody. And like, it's just like my immediate family that we have over because none of my other family lives close, so it's just like my fam my parents and my siblings. Um, so I help out. And, you know, may or may not have some tequila <laughs> with it. Where did I get an internship at? Um, the 
VA.